guys, how's it going? Lady Survival here. Happy New Year 2019. Um, today I finally decided at long last that I would do my bedroom tour um, because my bedroom's pretty sick and pretty Sylvanas, uh, gothic, World of Warcraft, nerd, purple <laughs> themed and I think it's awesome and my room just hasn't been like clean enough to do it. There's just been a lot of clutter and I'm like hardly ever at my parents house. I spend so much time at my boyfriend's that like I just haven't had the time to like do it. Yeah, here we are today. I figured since it is the start of um, 2019, um, I should probably get on top of doing things that I've wanted to do for a while. Um, also, I have not like vlogged like this holding my camera in a long freaking time. So I'm sorry if my arm is like shaking or anything of that sort or if I'm just awkward. I'm always awkward, but yeah. Also, of course, I'm just realizing that I'm almost out of storage on my camera, so I'm gonna have to fix that too. I really hope that you guys enjoy this uh, room tour kind of thing. It's not like 100% what I had pictured it to be. I had a lot of bigger plans for it and just like ended up not having the money to do what I wanted to do or just like being lazy or just not being here enough and all that kind of stuff. So I'm slowly transitioning into moving into my boyfriend's place. Um, I pretty much do currently live at my boyfriend's. It's just kind of like I spend way more time at my boyfriend's than I do here but I still like live here. It's kind of strange but I am going to be moving out officially hopefully within the next couple months so I always like to before I like move out of places I like to have like kind of a memory of what it looked like um, I just can't bring myself to take down like any of my Sylvana stuff until like I have kind of somewhat this is like my closure in a way so not only is this for you guys to see my room it's also like something that's really huge for me that's our little intro to this thing and I hope you guys enjoy this video thank you so much for watching thank you for all the support for anyone who's been following me for a really long time I just wanted to say again within the new year like I literally appreciate all of you guys who comment and like my videos and like watch my videos when I put them out and follow me on other platforms like you guys are seriously amazing and it just like blows my mind I sometimes get people who are like oh my god I've been here since like the beginning or I've been here since like 17 subscribers like some people remember like what subscriber they were and I'm just like holy crap that's crazy so I just wanted to say I appreciate you guys a lot so thank you for any support on my channel or my Instagram or anything like that I figured we would start outside of my room this is my bedroom door um, over here is my gaming area which is just like not obviously part of my room but I might talk about that in this video maybe separate who knows um, but this is my bedroom door opening and I'll just kind of give an overview of what my room looks like just kind of like from the start and all that stuff um, but we will be getting into things in more detail and everything but this is just to kind of get a sense of the bearings of my bedroom. Um, I'm just going to close my door because um, it's not necessary to see out there. Um, so when my door is closed, um, behind here I just have a curtain rod, I don't know why, that's just there. Um, and then I have this hook rack thing where I keep a lot of my just black, <laughs> black hoodies, um, alliance, um, a lights, hoodie thing, um, my horde crest, most prized possession ever, um, a We Came as Romans hoodie. So here I have some of my wigs, my red, white, black, and ombre pink one. So that is behind my door. Um, I used to have a Sylvanas poster here, but I moved it out into my gaming area, so this is kind of blank, but my bedroom door is typically open. Um, then over to the right here we have um, my closet, which literally is a disaster. There's so much junk in there. We're not opening that. It's just like, it <laughs> shows so much stuff in there, just random clothes that I have to donate, literally garbage, all that stuff. Um, I have this really cute um, plant thing, <laughs> decoration wall decor, which I just really like because it kind of reminds me of like elves or something. I think it's really cool. Um, over in this corner I have one of my shelves, kind of awesome, like World of Warcraft stuff. At the bottom here I just have some of my lights, uh, Skin and Earth comics and all that stuff. I have like every issue and every cover of each issue because there's two covers for each one. Um, this lights art exhibit thing, this really cool spell book wallet that my boyfriend got me but 
I don't really use it. I just think it looks cool. Um, I have some Horde and Alliance cups and a refreshing spring water glass because that's sick. And then just some, I literally have like 16 of these different cups in different colors. So they're just kind of all over the place. And up here I just have like all of my World of Warcraft books and Moon Colors by Lita, which I need to finish reading. I have like three chapters left or something. I stopped reading it like months ago. I don't know why, but I need to get on to that again because my hardcover of Shadows Burn is coming in the mail, so that's a thing. Um, and I did just want to also quickly point out that yes, I do read these. I don't know why a lot of people seem to think I just keep them. Um, I have read more than half of these and I will definitely finish reading the rest of them, hopefully this year, because that's like one of my 2019 goals is to read more books, so I will definitely do that. Um, World of Warcraft books are pretty much the only books that I can handle reading. I'm not a big reader, but because I adore Warcraft lore and just Azeroth as a whole, it makes it very enjoyable for me. Coming up, we have some of my World of Warcraft uh, action figures, which I kind of regret taking out of their boxes and I think throwing them out. I might have a few in the garage or something, but yeah, um, this one I found at Value Village. Uh, this was a gift, I believe, from my ex-boyfriend, as well as this one and this one, and I bought Illidan, so thanks, ex-boyfriend, that was dope. Um, I love them so much. Um, up here I just have one of my ultimate visual guides. I have two. Don't ask me why, I'm a freaking weirdo. Um, and then just some dollar store, like, Halloween things. This little Pusheen Christmas ornament that my boyfriend got me, this hand-crafted, um cord crest mug thing which I got from someone on Instagram. I'll try to put her name here. Um, this glass thing and another dollar store Halloween thing. Um, up here I just have some random stuff just like a vase with some fake flowers. Um, this really really cute um, candelabra which I never actually light. I just think it looks really cool. Um, this like crow stand. Oh god it's just dusty as hell. I'm sorry. With this purple flower thing and then there is one of my first of many Sylvanas posters up there as well. Moving over to this area, which is like my favorite place ever, and I take a lot of selfies. Um, this is a mirror from Ikea, which is a very basic, like, gothic mirror kind of thing. Um, I'm gonna get to my favorite area down below there, but I just want to also point out a lot of people see this in selfies that I take in that mirror, and they're like, what the hell, like, are you not horrid? And it's like, yes, I am, <laughs> but... I also do play Alliance occasionally and I just love World of Warcraft as a whole. And I have the Horde one over here. The reason why it's over here is because it's closer to that, my Sylvanas, so yeah. It just, just yeah, I just love all World of Warcraft things, yeah. <laughs> Moving on to my absolute, like, prized area in my room and my most prized possession as a whole. This is my little Sylvanas shrine area, so... This is the box that Sylvanas came in when I ordered this amazing, beautiful, I love you, <laughs> Sylvanas statue that costed me like $800 because it was originally like $350 US dollars and then it converted to Canadian, then the shipping, the tax, and then I got like a customs charge that was like almost $300, so that was hella expensive but I do not regret it. Um, then I just have a frame picture of Sylvanas here, I have a little action figure here. Um, a Sylvanas necklace with the Icon of Torment in it, which I have as a tattoo. Um, I have a um, Sylvanas pin, the Dark Lady's necklace, which was also handcrafted by the same person who did that. So check them out. They're cool. Um, some of the stuff fell off of it. There used to be little swirly bits on it, but they're not there. Um, then I have this giant coin emblem thing um, that came from my World of Warcraft Collector's Edition. Um, Battle for Azeroth, and it does have an alliance side, but of course, we'll have it on the Horde side. Um, and then I have another Sylvanas action figure here. And then these are two of my older phone cases that I had. That's for my old Samsung Galaxy S7. This is for an old iPhone, so I just keep those there. So I got those custom made for my queen, Dark Lady, I love you. And then my other visual guide. I don't, again, I'm just, I literally just love WoW so much that sometimes I just buy duplicates of things because why not? Um, and it's of course opened onto the Solana's page as well as this one over here. And then we move on to this area which is also 
as a whole in addition to this just this whole spot of my room is like my favorite I think it looks so cool I have so much stuff on the wall um, this mirror which is actually a mirror but then this one broke because my ex-boyfriend that I lived in an apartment with got angry and smashed it off the wall and it shattered but I did not throw it out I just broke the rest of the glass out and put a framed picture of the icon of torment which I ordered this off of Etsy I believe and I just like cut it into a circle this is a picture that I got from Michael's for Halloween last year I believe um, then I have some more dollar store stuff those things are just from the dollar store I like weird things like that I think they look sick um, some dream catchers which I got off Etsy like a few years ago um, another Sylvanas poster thing which I got printed at like Staples or something random um, my other horde flag thing which um, I got this and this off of like Wish I think they came together or something like that but I just really love how everything looks on my wall here I think it looks awesome how it's kind of like all like that and stuff it's really cool um, and just from far away I just I just adore it um, my bed is like my favorite place ever um, I love to film my videos here with all of my pillows and whatnot um, I do love sleeping up against pillows it feels very comfortable to me and I don't I don't like not having a lot of pillows it's my tentacle kitty that I got my first year of going to anime north and my cat has kind of destroyed it but I love it so much I have a video with my tentacle kitty that I'll link down below if you want to see that of course, on my bed, I do have a Sylvanas pillow. I love her. I can't really sleep without her. She is amazing. She gives me good dreams. I think she protects me from from bad things. Thank you. Dark lady, watch over you in your dreams and in real life. Um, this skull pillow is sick. I also got this from Michael's um, the same time I bought that, and it was from last year at Halloween. Um, back here I have a spirit hood that my boyfriend gave to me when we first met. Um, then I have some more Halloween decoration things which are technically supposed to like, they have like hooks to hang from the ceiling but I was too lazy to do that so they're just kind of sitting there. And then I also do have these cool little dragon mirrors which I got from Green Earth. Which and then this, oh my god I feel like I have so many just favorite areas of my room. Um, this is kind of like the centerpiece thing, like it's kind of the main thing that you see when you look into my room. Um, this is like the most beautiful picture of Sylvanas that I have ever seen in my entire life. I got this ordered off of Etsy as well, I think it was like $60. It's a very very nice wall scroll and I love how it looks with the lights around it. I have these little ornament things around it because I don't know. My coworker gave them to me so I just put them somewhere. but. I just think it looks so cool. I love, I love it. I love it so much. Up here I have another dream catcher that is actually hanging from the ceiling, but those ones aren't because I, I don't know. Over here I have my nightstand, which my aunt got for me many, many years ago. It just has some cats on it, which I freaking love cats. And then we also have, um, this is kind of like my diary kind of thing, which really reminds me of Suramar from World of Warcraft, the whole color scheme and like architecture of it is very nice. My brother got this for me a few Christmases back. Um, then here I just have some random gothic kind of stuff. I got this from Michael's at Halloween. Um, this is from Green Earth. My dad got me these little crystal jade cats from like British Columbia once when he went out there. This is just a really cool like skull light up candle thing that one of my internet friends uh, her name is Karina, or at Red Scarlet Missing on Instagram. She got that for me, and I really, really adore it. I have my window, which is really not that exciting, um, but I did put up this Warp Tour flag, which I thought looked cool, even though it's kind of random because it just covers like half of my window. Um, but this is the Warp Tour flag that I got because I ordered um, like the bundles for my boyfriend and I for the last Warp Tour ever. So I think that that looks pretty cool. It gives my room something awesome to look at instead of just a plain window I guess. Just down over here I have my tripod which I will set up kind of in this area with it like taller and stuff and film right there like that's where I put it and film myself on my bed typically is how I do my videos. Um, then down here I just have my awesome Vans backpack checkered things. It's super awesome. I carry that everywhere. It's like my purse. I don't use a purse typically so that's like my always go-to bag. Over to here we have another 
um, Sylvanas poster, which is just another beautiful, beautiful picture of her. I love it so much. We have my vanity, which I actually don't often do my makeup here. I literally only set all this stuff up as of today because I was like, well, I should probably make this look somewhat presentable. Typically when I do my makeup, I sit on the floor over here and just make a mess and throw everything down there. But for the video, I was like, whatever, I'll set up my vanity because why not? I have some fake flowers here and then I just have some of my like quick always like go-to makeup that I use all the time. Um, there's more stuff in this drawer here, but again, it's literally just a disaster zone in there like I'll literally there's just a bunch of shit there's like glue hello random I don't know um and then this is the makeup bag that I will um bring stuff like my lipstick or anything that I might need to touch up whenever I go like to work or something like that so I just throw in my necessities and put that in my bag so I can touch up anything I used to take a lot of selfies here but more so I used to have it over here and I took more selfies and then I don't really as much anymore. And over here I just have like a garbage bin and then a container with some cat food, some cat toy thing down there, and water and food for my cat because he likes to eat in here sometimes, the odd occasion. Um, this is just a fan from summertime that's just chilling there. Over here I just have this shelf thing that I've had for a long time and my dad and I actually painted it black. It used to be like a wood brown kind of color um, and I just have some random random stuff. I keep all my piercing jewelry in here. I have some perfumes and stuff, some hair stuff, hair stuff, perfumes, perfumes, candle, random. Uh, that's that thing. And then I just have this Harley Quinn Landard, lanyard keychain thing, which I don't even use. I have this World of Warcraft thing, a little switchblade thing, and that. And then this is my dresser where I keep like all my clothes. This is typically bras, underwear, pajama shorts and stuff like that. Uh, t-shirts and tank tops, um, more t-shirts and tank tops, and then like leggings, jeans, all that kind of stuff is down there. Um, which is again just a, a disaster zone so we're not going to get into that. Um, this mirror is another thing that my dad and I painted. It used to be like green and just disgusting but we painted it black. Um, I have this custom Sylvanas Xbox controller thing but I don't have my Xbox anymore because my ex-boyfriend who's a piece of trash decided to sell it to buy marijuana so I still have the sticker but my mirror where you can kind of see all my cool stuff in the background I have this random candle thing which never is used it just sits there because why not um, this is my ghost town wallet which I've had for a really long time it's the ghost town you're so creepy artwork which is actually based off of a picture of Lita which I think is sick here we have my big mirror which I do take a lot of selfies in and whatnot and you can see my beautiful Sylvana shrine over there um, I've never had a big mirror before until like last year I bought this and I I dig it it's cool because you can take cool selfies I don't know I look like shit right now um, but yeah that pretty much is my bedroom so behind my door the closet, the cool wall scroll art thing, uh, my shelf, Sylvanas, cool books, Sylvanas shrine, no big deal, mirror, cool stuff on the wall, Sylvanas, beautiful queen, lights, two mirrors, awesome, bed, nightstand, window, warp tour, Sylvanas, vanity, filming stuff, backpack, um, and hello, just this area. So yeah, that is kind of a recap of everything. I'm terribly sorry. I don't know why I'm just standing there. I'm I'm weird. Um, we'll just look over here. I'm terribly sorry if I'm just really bad at like room tours. I don't really know what to say or what to talk about and I tend to run out of breath every time I try to do this kind of stuff because I'm just so nervous and anxious. I want to show you guys I got this really cool fur jacket so I'm just going to put that on super quick and show you. I got this awesome fur jacket coat sweater thing from Forever 21, it was like 50% off and free shipping, so I paid like $27 for this. And it is just freaking amazing. It's so warm and so comfortable and just like, I love it so much. I feel like, like a wizard or something or some snow queen. I really don't know. It's so, so cool. So I just want to show you guys that because it's just extra as hell and I love it. So that was my bedroom tour thing. I'm sorry if it was really awkward or if I'm just really awkward and lame and talk too fast. I really finally got around to doing this so I can maybe kind of sort of slowly start packing up some of my things and transitioning into moving into my boyfriend's. 
I um, will do a separate video kind of showing my gaming area that's like outside in the other room because I feel like this one's just a bit too long to continue doing that. Um, so interested in seeing that please let me know in the comments down below and let me know if there's anything else that you want me to do a video of in my room or just anything to do with my room before I like move out officially because there's probably like one or two months before that'll happen. Um, kind of awkward now I don't really know what else to say or do so I'm just gonna put this hood on because why not it's it's nice I feel like a snow queen. At note, uh, Dark Lady, watch over you. If you love Sylvanas, you are amazing. Let me know in the comments down below how you feel about my Sylvanas bedroom, and I will talk to you guys again soon.